Hi there, this is Robert at Scott Leroy Marketing. Today we're going to show you how to add a contact to the new KW Command CRM system that KW International has developed. This was originally only available to certain agents, but it should be generally available beginning in 2019, so we wanted to get ahead of the curve here. To access KW Command, we're going to visit agent.kw.com. The previous login page used to be login.command.kw.com, which is very long, so they changed it to agent.kw.com. Here you'll see the lab's login dashboard, which is going to be uh, the same as Keller Cloud. And this login information is going to be the exact same username and password that you use to log into mykw.kw.com. They're synced. They're one and the same. Once you're logged in, you'll be brought to the command dashboard, and there are two ways to access the contact list to create a new contact. One is here in the dashboard homepage itself. You can just click on contacts, or over here on the left in the short menu, you can click on the same icon, the two people silhouetted here, and that will take you to contacts as well. Once you're in your contact list, over on the far right at the top, there should be a red button that says add new contact. We'll click on that. And here's where we would add our information for this contact that we're going to be adding to command. The only thing that's required is a name. This is different from the eEdge database system where you had to have a name and a form of contact, whether it was email, phone number, or physical address. Here, all you have to have is a name, like John Smith. And then you can just save the contact down here at the bottom, or you can add additional contact details for this person. We'll just save that contact. And now that contact is here in my commands database. That's how you can add a new contact to your KW command database. If you have any questions about that, feel free to send us an email at support at scottleroymarketing.com.